Hey, what's going on, Internet? Zyjix here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle Network 4 Let's Play. And last time, uh, Lan started out his date with Melu, and a bunch of toy robots went crazy now. And so now we got to fix them by fixing their stories. Right now, I'm in the Wiz Dog. We got the portion of the story we need to get the. I know it was a good nose, that was one of them, because it just sounds so ridiculous. Um, good scratch. Alright, I believe those are, those are the correct ones. And of course, the virus has got to get in the freaking way! Whatever, the Vulcan's always fun to use. I should be able. To, I should be able to t take out the uh, binder guy there and fairly quickly here. It's like so. That was easy. Alrighty. So now I said earlier that um, basically a sure thing in the first tournament I was going to be getting gut soul. Um. There's two navvies that we can get a double soul from. We can get it either from Roll or we can get it from Windman. But I don't know who it's going to be. I think at this point it's kind of randomized. So, yeah, spoiler alert. Anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. Read the story. Let's just get on with it. What the heck? Huh? Something strange. Is the raft broken? Ah, it moved. Now, now, no need to look so worried. It's perfectly safe on top of the raft. It, it, is, re it is really. A bit of foreshadowing there. <sighs> Eggman pressed the toy robo stop switch, and at the same time of pressing the button, the virus started. Of course. Now they're getting... Even angrier now no I don't think I can hit him with the I can't hit him with the wide sword so there's no point in using that probably should have waited to counter him if I can do that instead that's better okay one down as long as I don't get hit by these electrical balls. I don't want to beat them around so that way they just kind of wear out. Alright, another one down. Ah, crap. Of course I gotta get hit by one. At least, at least I gotta get hit by at least one. Haha, <laughs> stupid! And with that said, uh, that this toy robot is uh, fixed. Uh, the next, well, they're all they're all kind of facing. There wasn't one here before. I ran up this way. Whatever, we're gonna jack in. Now we're in the th what was, yeah, it's the third robot here or third of four. I've been waiting. Welcome to Tin Man Cyber World. As you know, Tin Man is currently running amok and blah blah. blah. Yeah, just let me go. I gotta go find story pieces. The virus is gonna get up on the raft, isn't it? Something strange. It feels like we're being watched. Alright, this is a sad story of the robot Tin Man. This robot had been originally built for blank, I'm pretty sure that's war. But now he lived in a quiet life alone in the woods. As the ro as a robot Tin Man didn't have any pretty sure emotions, but desiring this gift so much that he often prayed for it. Okay, so we're gonna get war and emotions. BMD over here. There's not, and I just wasted my. Whoops. All right, 
There's one. And not pride. Alright, go ahead and put war and emotion and blah. Done. I don't really need to feel I really don't feel like I need to read through these more than once. Um Blank was Tin Man's friend, and one day he suddenly became still and lifeless. Now cold and without a sign of life, this friend would not reply to Tin Man's calls. Even when he used his blank, nothing happened. I don't believe the answers are like anything like uh, AFV. They're always the most ridiculous ones that make it. Um, probably hit two, eight, kill two birds with one stone here. Or not. I, you know, can move faster. I need healing. Alright, there we go. Oh boy, this is not good. Alright. I just need one more sword here, and I can just lay waste to s at least one of these viruses. Okay, now you're about to see what happens when Mega Man gets nervous. Oh, never mind. No, never mind. Uh, I, that actually won't happen until a little later. Um, but yeah, it's, holy crap, first time he's actually gotten nervous. Probably because I suck! Oh, that's not good. Crap. Craptastic. Oh my god. Alright, as long as I think as long as he heals a, a reasonable amount, he'll be fine. Okay, there. That that was much better. Alright, now we can yeah. Uh, when Mega Man's nervous, he cannot unite either, if you didn't notice. Alright, there we go. That was a close one. We gotta do a bit better battling so we can get some health back. Um, let's see. It was not zombie. It was. I think it was a bird. Nope. Uh, I believe dance was one of them. And bird, yeah. Well, watch as I get attacked before I hit the boat. Ne never mind. All right, one well, bird. Dance. Yeah, here's where we get attacked by freaking viruses now. From under the rafters! Ah! Viruses! Oh, you're not that bad. As long as I don't get hit. Ah, oh, shoot. Come on. So, you know, I don't know why I'm not making use of this. There we go. Got some kind of healing. Gonna live! Predict where that stupid puck is gonna go. Yeah, this this would be plenty useful. Perfect. You okay? No virus has ever gotten on top of the, the raft before, but we chased him away, so everything should be fine now. Right? Let's get started. Let's get settled and start on our way. Because I don't feel like dying. Um. Okay. Without emotion, uh, Tin Man could not understand death. Moved by his plight. God decided to give Tin Man emotion. Uh, really? They're gonna put God in a game? I thought like Capcom or not Nintendo had a an anti or not an anti-religious, but like a non-religious policy. Whatever. However, Tin Man had been used in so many wars. Now, remembering his horrible deeds, he felt deep anguish. To atone for his deeds, he decided to be a blank and to make up for his wrongs. Wrongs he 
he'd make dreams come true as he left for the woods and made for town he almost seemed a little happy um i'm gonna because i don't yeah like i was gonna say earlier because i don't want to die i feel like i need to jack out so i can jack back in and get my health back all right get going i don't have to redo any of that so that's good news no i don't want to get off keep going I believe it was like something like toy parts. Like the MD, regular up to man, regular up is all over the place. Be able to get away from these guys, right? Yep. Uh, no, oh, no that's not it. Definitely not a politician. I don't even think politicians have emotions. Uh, dancer. No, that's still not it. All right, one more. Gonna get one more. Boy part. There it is. And we're gonna get back there. Hopefully, I don't get freak. I swear to God, if I get freaking jumped by virus, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> that's insert toy part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yet again, another freaking virus. Alright, perfect. Perfect! Get Gut Soul here and two Vulcans. Be able to get rid of these guys fairly quickly. As long as I don't miss. Ouch, just not paying attention. That'll have to do. He takes a he takes Ah dang it. Come on, really? Well, just friggin' wonderful. No. Not like that. Alright, got him. There we go. I don't know what... I, I don't know if... It, Still, or if I'm a bit more sick than I thought I was, because I just, I just do not, I just don't feel like I have the energy to, like I did uh, a couple days ago. Phone call, hello? Man, yeah, Toy Robo has gone into the Vampa Manor. Okay, I'll be right there. Stay where you are. I will. Be careful, man. I will. Wait there and leave it to me, because I'm the man and you're the woman and you can shut the hell up and do as I say. Mega Man, we have to head over to the Vampa Manor, quickly. Let's go. But anyhow, um, like so as I probably said in the last video, this is the part where um, Ken and Dean to uh, know the uh, path layout here. Ah! It's pitch dark! This is what Toy Robo's doing. Let's try to remember the route we took before. Good. Which, in all reality, it's not that hard because really all you have to do is just kind of walk along the walls and eventually you find it. I'm not going anywhere. Should have been using the scenery as a guide there. Alright, there he is. Alright, last one. Land, this area seems different than all the others. Strange, I, I get a sense of danger. Hmm, something seems out of place to me too. Well, we can't afford like we can't afford to start shaking our boots here. Yeah, let's get moving. Roger. Ah, Mega Man, what's up? I'm not sure. I for a second I felt an evil force seem to pass through my body, but I'm okay now. Let's keep going. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the Dark Ship now affecting Mega Man. Welcome. This is Dracky Cyberworld. This is a story versus Solar Boy versus Vampire. 
heard something of th something about things going crazy outside, but you needn't worry about that. R ready to ride? Yeah. I don't know if that, that liquid is supposed to be wa uh, lava or blood. No need to be so startled. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I'm sure you're trying to kill me. Chapter 1. Jingle the Solar Boy. Carried blank the solar gun and with bl and with the blank had been worn by... Uh, I believe that's scarf. Same night, the lid of a giant... Uh, yeah, who, I don't care. I, I already know what it is. Jango goes and fights a a, a a vampire. He's got a solar gun that shoots sun or yeah sunlight. That's definitely not it. Not red you wear. Oh freaking great! Well, at least they're manageable now. Crap! Too early on both of them. Wrecked. No, you're not taking that away from me. Crap. No. Trying, trying to predict that path is ridiculous. Alright, that one's dead, so now I can just take these two here and get the heck out of the way. Like doing some healing and now I could actually get both of them. Wow, this is gonna be uh, those swords are gonna be super useless here. <laughs> no, all right, I'm just I'm not I'm not in the mood for this. Die. Gun soul, that's it. That's one of them. A uh, Walsh P37? No, that's definitely not it. I'm guessing that's Cream Scarf. I I don't know. It's it's so weird how like they just condense these names together. All right, we're using Gun Soul and the Cream Scarf. Blah 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 blah. Yes, I know I'm right. All right, and this is where it gets ridiculous because these are like literally right next to each other. Chapter two, on his travels, Django met Blank, the Sun Spirit, and they decided to travel together. Just a little after starting off, the Sun Spirit felt an extraordinary evil force coming from the east. The two travelers then started walking in that direction. <sighs> ah, crap. All right, um, I was looking for, for, then, I know it started with an O. I believe that's what it was. Alright. Got more HP memory. Sweet. Up to 250 now. Of course I can't run from these guys. Yeah, of freaking course. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll heal real quick. And then try to, well, try to counter him. Dang it, are you kidding? Oh, Just as I go to counter him, he gets freaking shielded. Alright, well, you know I'm taking this guy out first because he's annoying. You little. <laughs> no! Run away, you little twerp! And of course, the other viruses get right in the way. Come on, get where I can hit you, you little fart knocker. Wow, this thing is like, yeah, up yours! Screw you! I 
counter him real quick. Nope. Everything has got to be itching all at the same time here. Right? Probably. Yeah, I hit him with a sword. Was no, a little early there. There we go. Okay, never mind. I did counter him and he did. It wasn't just after he just initially took off. Or... Uh, no, that's not right. Sunlight, no. Moonlight, also no. How is it? Otenko. God almighty, freaking viruses. I mean, I know I'm gonna have to fight him at some point, it's just that it's, they get really tedious at this point because I'm trying to do something else. Anyhow. But anyhow, with that said, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and stop right here. If you guys like this video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. I'll be seeing you all in the next video. So thank you all very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.